If you haven't watched this video yet, I recommend watching it before moving on to the next. We just heard from Rachel's mom there. How is the family doing? Being left with so many questions for so long, finally getting answers, but ones that are very difficult to hear. Being left with unanswered questions for so long made him feel anxious and unsettled. She found herself being left with a pile of unfinished tasks, causing frustration and stress. Being left with only memories and regrets, he couldn't help but feel a sense of longing for what once was. Hartford County Sheriff Jeffrey Gallagher had this to say. Listen here. I have this to say. Honesty is always the best policy. She has this to say about the situation. It's far more complex than it appears. We have this to say to our customers. Your satisfaction is our top priority. Yeah, well, I mean, there are countless law enforcement agencies who worked this case every single day for the past 10 months. Some of them even traveled to El Salvador to find out who this person is. So incredible work done by them, but unfortunate that that work needed to take place. She spent countless hours studying for the exam, determined to succeed. Countless memories flooded back to him as he walked through the old neighborhood. Despite facing countless challenges, she never lost sight of her dreams. So incredible work done by them, but unfortunate that that work needed to take place. So incredible effort put in by the team but unfortunate that the project faced so many setbacks. So incredible talent displayed by the performers, but unfortunate that the event had to be canceled due to unforeseen circumstances. So incredible dedication shown by the volunteers, but unfortunate that the weather conditions made the task much more challenging. We obviously need to reform it, because doing nothing is not actually solving the problem, it's making it worse. Ignoring mental health issues isn't simply overlooking personal well-being, it's actually exacerbating societal challenges. Postponing repairs on critical infrastructure isn't just delaying maintenance, it's actually increasing the risk of infrastructure failure. Doing nothing to address immigration issues is not merely avoiding the problem, it actually contributes to its worsening effects. And he is doing nothing but sitting on it and standing in the way. It is shameful. It is disgraceful. She is doing nothing but complaining about the situation without taking any action to improve it. They are doing nothing but procrastinating on the project, causing delays and frustration. The government is doing nothing but ignoring the needs of its citizens, leading to widespread dissatisfaction. There is no reason for Chuck Schumer, other than politics, to be sitting on this bill. There is no reason for her other than personal gain to be delaying the approval of this project. There is no reason for them other than financial interests to be opposing this policy change. He refuses to participate in the event for no reason other than personal dissatisfaction.
The company canceled the project for no reason other than financial constraints. If you enjoy this content, please consider subscribing to my channel to stay up to date with future videos. Thank you for watching.